Hi everyone, it's David here at DigiTrains and today we've got a little tips video for you um, regarding the very popular Zumo MX600R 8-pin motor decoder. And we'll be looking at how to attach a stay alive to it. Now I did a previous video on this quite a while ago, a couple of years ago, and it's been brought to our attention by one of our customers that the decoder has ever so slightly changed. So if you're familiar with the older version of the decoder, it had a large solder pad here that was a ground pad. Now on the newer version, the revised version, um, it doesn't have this. So we were a little bit interested to know where there would be a ground pad. Um, so Jeremy in the workshop had a little bit of a play and had a look at the decoder and discovered that between these two components here, there is a pad. You can see quite clearly here, this little gold pad. Um, so that is the ground pad on your decoder. So here is one that he's soldered a wire to, just to show you where you need to attach. So it's just on there. So if you're using something like the Lay Stay Alive, I've got here, that is where your black wire would attach to. So your black wire would attach to that little pad there. Now your common wire still remains your blue wire on here. That's exactly the same. So your blue wire from your stay alive attaches to your blue common wire there. So there we are. I hope you find that useful. Um, obviously if you've bought one of these and you were used to using the old decoder, the methods are slightly different this time, but it still works just as well. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time.